Hey everybody, long time no see. I am the BBG and I am walking to Disneyland. I'm walking up uh, Harbor Avenue and um, I parked in the neighborhood. I hope I don't get towed or ticketed, but we'll find out later. So um, I haven't been there since before the situation back in uh, early 2020. So um, I'm really excited. Please, please subscribe or like it really helps i don't want to make money off this but the more people the more fun this is i am inside oh by the way i checked on the what's that called again the season passes no the magic key it's called and apparently at 10 o'clock i get to upgrade my day ticket and i should be able to do it on the app so let's see if that's gonna work <sighs> so close well i mean i am inside but let's see i just wanted to show the horse pulling the cart i'm here in front of the castle people taking pictures in front of mr disney and um what am i going to do oh two things you notice i'm not wearing a mask that's because you don't need to wear a mask when you're outside here only when you go indoors and the second thing is, I got myself a boarding pass for Rise of the Resistance. Now, and you don't need to be in the park for that. You could actually do it at home. Just get on the app at 7 o'clock in the morning. Selfie in front of Walt Disney. One of the things I like, well, the positive things about, oh, there's a, uh, I forgot what that's called. Oh, the Astro Glider. Anyway, Star Tour is over there. One of the things I like about the pandemic well, there's nothing really much to like about the pandemic, but one of the positive things is Disneyland is not packed body to body. I know if you look at my previous videos, you can see that. Anyway, how about we give Space Mountain a try? I am here at Space Mountain and the mask is on because we are going indoors. Love Space Mountain. And check this out. There's a, uh, can you see it? 10 minute wait. Yay. Wow, I really love this ride. Um, well, I mean, it's too dark to film anything, so we'll see you guys later. Oh, here we go. Okay, well, that was fun. Oh, look, let me show you the picture. Here I am over there. Yay, don't I look like I'm having fun? You can see my, my uh, smile of excitement through my mask. Anyways, uh, what am I gonna do next? I don't know, let's just walk around, I guess. Where to, where to, where to? Oh, Matterhorn, everybody? Matterhorn, Matterhorn. What? They're, they're refurbishing this? I didn't see that on the website. Man, and I like that ride too. Okay, well, here's Matterhorn. Well, waiting in line now. No single rider. Oh wow, this is gonna be fun. Oh, darkness. Okay, this is no reason to scream. Oh! Yo! This is always, this is always, oh! Okay, that, that actually scared me! Whoa! Ah! Oh man. I'm still on it, but the ride is over. Um, that was fun. Matterhorn's, Matterhorn's always a fun but bumpy ride. Ooh, fun fact. This is the exact same ride in um, Space Mountain in Orlando. It's the same track, except it's indoors. Here's an observation I made about Disneyland, well, and Disney World too, is that they let you get on the rides with your phone and your and they let you pull it out and record. There's no theme park I've ever been to that allows you to do that. So how did they get away with it? I was so hungry that I bought myself a corn dog. $10, ladies and gentlemen. Well, at least it's good. So now I get to uh, do Small World. That's another thing that's different here. The boat starts on the outside and goes inside and in florida you're already inside 
I don't think that's that big of a deal, but whatever. Now that I think of it, I don't think I've been in the one here on Disneyland. Wow. All the times I've been in Small World and I didn't do the one at Disneyland, shows you how much I like this ride. And now I'm gonna have lunch at the Plaza Inn. So we're gonna see how it's like when um, there's no characters. Well, I got myself a nice little tasty chicken dinner and a chocolate cake. I, I was hungry, so I took a bite. Well, that was actually pretty good. I liked it a lot. Ooh, we're off to now. Um, Indiana Jones, let's do that. Here we are waiting in the line. Uh, I gotta put the mask on, the Slytherin mask, as soon as I get inside. Okay, phone is just about to die, so let's do a huge time jump while the phone recharges, and we'll be back. Time jump, I told you there'd be a time jump. Um, I'm waiting for Rise of the Resistance. Well, you can't really see anything in the line, so um, I'll turn it on a little bit later. But I'm filled with anticipation. Recruits, thank you for joining the cause. A covert resistance team led by my friend Finn has infiltrated a first order. This is by far my favorite part, well, one of my favorite parts. That was amazing as usual. So right now we're going to do what I had mentioned earlier. I am going to go to the Del Sol Inn, show you the room because I got a little room there. So we'll check it out. It's Tigger. And um, here's the entrance to the Del Sol Inn. You just go behind there as if you were going to the parking lot of Denny's so you can kind of miss it. It's not the Desert Inn, it's a Del Sol and that is where my room is and you see the entrance to Disneyland is right there literally on the other side of the street. It's pretty nice here and I will show you the room. Now I've got a group of people staying with me, family, but they're not here yet, so you get to see the family room. We've got uh, two queen-sized beds, a uh, bunk bed here for the kids, and of course, here is the bathroom, a little sink, a fridge. Wow, I think it's pretty nice. Um, it is evening. Yeah, I know there's still light outside, but it's seven o'clock right now, and I am in California Adventure, so we're gonna check out um, what are we going to check out? Avengers Campus, of course. Wow. And by the way, I managed to turn my ticket into season pass so there'll be more Disney videos. Well, here is uh -huh, Mission Breakout, formerly known as Hollywood Tower Terror. Oh, I see it right there. Oh. This is Avengers Campus. Tim Test Kitchen, I gotta check that out. Wow. Okay, I saw this particle fuzz thing and I was like, I gotta try it out. So I am gonna wait in line and try it. This is called the particle fizz. I don't even know what's in it. I just looked at it and thought it looked cool, but it costs $14. What, what's in it? Like vodka? I, I don't even know if it's an alcoholic drink. It tastes like a light beer. Eh, I don't think I'll be having this again, but. A light beer, that's how it tastes like. Okay, I drank that a little too quickly, so I'm a little traumatized now. But um, I actually put myself on the virtual queue for the Spider-Man ride, so we'll check that out later. Uh, what do I do while I wait? Check out Incredicoaster. I just thought the Avengers Campus sign looked kind of cool. Well, everyone, here is the Incredicoaster. We'll check that out. 
I kind of liked it when it was uh, California Screaming. It seems like the California theme is slowly fading away from here, but it doesn't matter. It's still great. I like Pixar Pier. The same thing. They let you have your phone on the ride. Oh, I love this part. This at the end, so cool. Okay, oh, now, what is next? The Spider-Man ride is next, and we're gonna go to Hank Pig's kitchen to have uh, another uh, BBG taste test. Can't wait. Okay, well, here's what I got from Hank's Pim kitchen. A not so little chicken sandwich. Looks really good. Let's give it a try. Okay, how am I supposed to eat this? Um, it is what it is. It's you know, spicy. The night ends with web slingers. We're gonna see how good that is, and you're gonna get an official BBG review. Got my boarding pass. It's similar to um, Rise of the Resistance. Oh, cool. Somehow I think green tile. Watch this be like Midway Mania. Okay. Yes, I am seeing um, Midway Madness vibes. Okay, well, I'm about to get on and I'll give you a full review. Just as I suspected, it is a better version of Midway Madness. It's actually kind of fun. I liked it. Nothing like the one in Orlando, by the way. Okay. It's the end of the night. I'm the BBG. Please like. Please subscribe. Thank you for watching.